Agency has come to the Sea of Thieves. Own your own ship, unlock deeper levels of customization, and earn new rewards through an all-new progression system. So get ready to set sail as a captain of adventure in Sea of Thieves Season 7. In Season 7, hand over some gold and you can buy your very own ship. You'll be able to buy one of each type of ship, but that's just for starters. Owning a ship means you can give it a name. Yes, now you can finally sail the seas with a name of your choosing proudly displayed across the ship's crest. Just make sure to keep it classy. The Pirate Lord won't allow just any old nonsense up there. Huh? Maybe he will. You can also now customise the captain's cabin across all ship types. Change up the chair, table, the rug and much more to better reflect your individual tastes. You can take it a step further with trinkets too. Hang pictures on the wall or place trophies on the shelf. Trinkets are a new way for you to show off your style and accomplishments. A brutal battle or rough storm might knock them out of place. So for the pirate perfectionists, you'll want to give them a nudge to keep them looking ship -shape. First impressions are everything, you know. For a small amount of gold, any changes to the customizations across your ship can now be saved between sessions. So your ship will be just as you left it last time you sailed. That includes things like the scars of battles too. So if you had a rough journey last time, that'll be visible on your ship. If holes and scratches aren't your thing, you can, of course, get a fresh lick of paint from the shipwright. One way to unlock new ship customizations is via a new progression system called Milestones. Milestones are a permanent record of your accomplishments and those of your ships. They're divided into alignments, each representing an area of activity within the game allowing you to see and track the ways that you play and earn unique rewards for it. And you can bring even more variety and customization to your adventures with Captain's Voyages. These unique voyages cover all trading companies and offer you the ability to target specific activities. Captain's Voyages offer both very short single map objectives and longer commissions that bring together various activities for the company in one combined voyage. This puts how you play firmly in your hands. How long your voyages are and what activities you'll engage in is up to you. At each outpost, you'll now find a new group, the Sovereigns. They like to portray an air of exclusivity so they'll only deal with captains. Deliver any of the loot you'd normally take to the other outpost companies directly to the Sovereigns, and they'll do the rest of the legwork for you. You still get the same gold and reputation as you would have, it's just much easier. And speaking of convenience, there's also a handy harpoon up top to quickly offload the loot from your ship. And that's not the only thing we're making easier. By visiting the shipwright on any outpost, you can now stock your ship with planks, cannonballs and food, buy new captain's voyages, and repair your ship to pristine condition. Each time you sail on a captain's ship, you'll also have access to the captain's logbook, a personalised record of your crew and their adventures, as well as treasured accomplishments. This shows information about what the crew has achieved in their current session. And if you manage to sink a captain's ship, you can steal their logbook and sell it to the Reaper's Bones for gold and reputation. And that's not all. Season 7 is stuffed full of all new rewards to earn as you progress. With over 100 levels of sensational rewards to unlock, there's something for everyone. This includes the Perilous Seas flag and sails for your ship, as well as the Perilous Seas scar, tattoo and makeup for your pirate. And if you're looking for some fun in the sun, there's also a selection of items to get you into the summer vibe. You can also earn the entire Courage of Captaincy clothing set, the perfect way to celebrate the arrival of Captaincy 
to the Sea of Thieves, and pirate legends can now style themselves as the fan favourite hunter Merrick, with Merrick's jacket and cutlass. There's also a selection of new emissary rewards to unlock too, with a drum and concertina for each trading company. You'll have plenty of ways to bring sweet music to the seas. And with Season 7 comes a new Plunder Pass, available as an optional purchase, where you can unlock stunning cosmetics, as well as 250 ancient coins. With three variations of the Baleful Bloom costume, you can reenact the tale of a stranded sailor and their unfortunate encounter with a mind-controlling plant. You can also earn the entire Beachcombers Bounty Collector's ship set. This valiant vessel was saved from the brink of destruction and was stitched back together with whatever nature provided. Be sure to keep it well watered. And over in the Pirate Emporium, there are new items in stock. With the Wrecker Wrangler weapon set, these glowing toothy terrors are bound to spell deep trouble for your enemies. The Portable Portrait Emote Bundle is perfect for pirates who know that they are the most picturesque sight on the seas. And with the Wrecker Wrangler ship set, you'll be able to flaunt your affinity for the fang-faced fish from the flag down to the figurehead. Wrecker fish are more commonly spotted around shipwrecks, so put those cannons to use and send another crew down to see the wreckers for themselves. And if you can't get enough of glowing eyes, fangs and fins, then the Wrecker Wrangler costume is the one for you. And keep your enemies guessing, are you dangerous or just drunk? With the Bilge Rat Weapon Pose Emote. There's also a selection of new crests to adorn your ship. Even if you're already starting to regret the choice of name, at least you can show it off in style. And finally, there's the promising portrait emote, which is free to all players. Ah yes, very handsome. So get ready to revel in your accomplishments, experience a whole new level of customization, and enjoy all the benefits of being a captain in Sea of Thieves. Season 7. Thank you very much for watching. If you liked what you just saw and want to stay up to date with all the latest Sea of Thieves news, then hit subscribe and click that little ship's bell for all those notifications. Cheers.